So it's time for the new signee to come out. And they got the podium out there. We're all waiting. I should mention, by the way, this was, of course, Daily's Place. It's the same place they do all their shows. They did have uh, basically a big, giant TV screen on the stage the guys would walk out on for cool video effects. And that was awesome. So that, that helped. But the music starts to play. And I don't know if you've heard of this, Brian, but I'm not a huge fan of Total Nonstop Action or Impact Wrestling, any of the names that company has used. But one of the great things in the history of that company is Christian Cage's music. And when it starts, like sit up, I'm like, wait a minute. That's Christian Cage's music. Not Christian. That's Christian Cage's music. And sure enough, it's Christian Cage. And he's got a new catchphrase about hardest worker ever or can't be outworked, whatever the hell it said. It's better than either of those. But he comes out, there's a big ovation, and he grabs the contract, and he looks around, and he does the, the, the most dramatic pause. Like he was waiting to get attacked from behind and somebody else signed this contract. And then he signed it, and he left. <laughs> that was it. You know, it. I, I actually don't know if that was his, his TNA music. It sounded like the music, but if it also sounded like it might have been a ripoff of his TNA music. That's not impossible. Yes. But uh, it was a, a accurate ripoff then. Yes. I... I mean, listen, I like Christian. I mean, is he Brock Lesnar or The Rock? No. He so if you not. were expecting that, I don't blame you for being let down, but I like Christian. I watched the Royal Rumble. I thought he outworked almost everybody in the Royal Rumble. It was Rumble. tremendous. The it was fucking awesome. Yeah. He hadn't wrestled in like seven years. Yes. So I was fine. So at this point, I couldn't help but notice in the last few segments, we had seen a guy named Paige win. Excuse me, uh, yeah, a guy named Paige win. Then a guy named Paige debuted. Then a guy named Cage debuted. Then another guy named Cage was going to wrestle. We saw Dallas Page earlier in the show. I can only assume Page from Fighting With My Family and Robbie Rage and Nick Gage are on their way into this company now. I want it to be like a 30-year storyline where, like in Star Wars, they're all actually related. Sure. Yeah, that'd be, that would be great. If you enjoy these videos, for just $7.99 per month, you can enjoy full-length editions of The Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, Figure Four Daily with Tom Lawler and Lance Storm, plus hundreds of archived shows, all in beautiful HD. Don't miss out. Join us today.